Hi, welcome to WeddingPhotographyGig.com. I'm Ryan Oakley, and this is step one in our tutorial to make you a fabulous professional wedding photography website through SmugMug. So step one is all about signing up with SmugMug, and because this step is so simple, I'm going to add an extra bit to it. So we're going to sign up with SmugMug, and we are going to upload our first gallery. So, if you uh, if you haven't been to the uh, the page that has the uh, the complete pro wedding photography website tutorial from A to Z on my website, uh, you can go to that. There's the uh, the link is uh, uh, through my website. Go to the sidebar and go to this uh, this banner here. So if you if you're not on this page, the best way to do that is to come to any page, click here, and you'll get to our tutorial page. And from here, I want you to uh, to just read as much of this as you can, but if not, if you just want to jump into the tutorial, that's great, just so you know we are using SmugMug. So the best way to do that, to get into SmugMug, is to go through my uh, affiliate link and my banner here. And the main reason is for you to do that is you will get a 20% discount uh, off your first year of SmugMug by going through my affiliate link. Um, but just so you know, as you'll see in a second, you won't have to put out your credit card until the 14-day free trial is up. And uh, the 14-day free trial is going to be plenty of time for us to be able to get your site up and running completely and uh, for you to test out all the uh, wonderful features of SmugMug. And if you don't uh, like it and it's not fitting your needs, uh, just don't pay when those 14 days are up and your site is deleted and you're not charged a cent. So risk-free, but tons of benefits. So here we go. So first thing you need to do to, to uh, well, let me just remind you what we're going to create here. We are creating Z website. So we're going A to Z. A being you don't have a website. Z is this website here, some screen grab, so a home page. Well, actually, let's just show you what you're going to see. Here's the site. Here's the website. Perfect. All right, let's get to it. Let's go back, and we are going to get SmugMug through uh, through this link here. Uh, if you're not on my page for whatever reason, you can also go to weddingphotographygig.com/smugmug, and it will take you to this link as well. So we click on the link here. SmugMug pop pops up. Here's the coupon wedding gig right there, which is going to get you your 20% 20, 20 off eventually. Don't worry about it now. Once you're in, it knows that you came in through my affiliate link, so you'll get that 20% off. So let's go ahead and put in your email and a password and uh, do your site name. So for me, I'm going to use my email, but I'm going to add a little something to it. And I'm going to create a password, create a site name. Well, Everything's going to be around uh, this Johnny Walker photography, so I'm going to go with Johnny Walker photography. I'm just going to go with two because the site that I've created already is not one, but <laughs> this is the second one, so this is after. Or this is a, kind of a, a dummy site to walk you through the process. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and start my free trial. All right, so we're creating our first gallery here. We need a gallery name. now. The nice thing is uh, we get to work off of uh, normally. I mean, this is a this is a great place to start with a website. But when you don't have a sort of an end goal or an end vision of what your website's going to look like, you kind of walk through these things blindly. But the nice thing about this tutorial is we do have a we have an end goal and we do have a vision for our website. This is what we want. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, create some client galleries. So we're going to plug these in. And if you uh, if you have some clients right now and you got some galleries, great. That's this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna load these things in. Um, if you don't have client galleries, the best thing to do right now is to um, you know find find some portrait photography uh, weddings that you've shot you know from uh, just as a guest um, and create galleries as if they are paying clients. Um, now you don't have to say they're client galleries, you can just say they're portrait galleries or your work or something like that, but you definitely want to start filling your website out as if you've got um, you know, clients and paid gigs and all that stuff because, um, because you want to be seen as, you know, you just don't want to start from scratch. Now you've definitely got great 
uh, portrait photography out there. So go ahead and use those portraits from your uh, from your library and your computer to fill out these galleries. So, okay, I'm gonna walk through the t uh, these galleries in this tutorial as if I've got four clients already. So let's go ahead and do that. So the first one is gonna be Brittany and Mark. All right, actually. So what I wanna do is I wanna create my own category and I'm gonna call this client. And I'm gonna leave the default theme. I'm gonna use square thumbnails and it's gonna be a public gallery. So I can leave everything else as is. I'm gonna save this and it's gonna say, Let's go upload. Now your uploader might look a little bit different than this. Uh, there's different uploader options through SmugMug. This is just happens to be the one that I've got. So, and it remembers on each uh, computer. So you can try different up uploaders or just start with whatever they're giving you on your site. So I'm gonna go ahead and upload my gallery. So this is Brittany and Mark. So I'm just gonna select all my files and drag and drop. All right, so. Our final uh, photos in our gallery are uploading to our site and then we'll be able to uh, to go in and see what our new site looks like before we go and uh, change everything <laughs> all right so there we go so I hit the I'm done uploading but okay so now that we're back we're, we're in our gallery not back in our gallery but this is our gallery so it uh, looks a lot like our regular galleries so there we go so just pretty standard smug mug stuff here I'm not going to go into a lot of the details of, of certain smug mug things I'm just going to keep this tutorial really tight but obviously we've got a lot of work to do to get our site to look like that but we will get there for now this is our site and uh, we can go back to our home page by going here and this is the site uh, uh, how SmugMug has it set up what's called the back end for you to be able to go in and do a bunch of different things if you want to see what your site looks like to your visitors right now without touching anything go visitor view and there we go it is uh, in my opinion not very pretty right now but that's why we're gonna get us to uh, I'm gonna help you get to a site that looks like this but that's the end of tutorial one uh, tutorial two or step two we are going to um, customize this gallery that we just uh, saw, uh, do, the, do the gallery settings, and we are going to upload a few more galleries. All right, thanks, and we'll see you in the next video.